Goat's back on the long drive. I'll tell you. Okay, here's the thing. We need to find... Wait a minute. Is that... No, that's not it. We need to find another Trabant today because I discovered there's a poo. It's just dancing. Um, that I may have been trying to use the mod wrong. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Speeding on my road. Oh, God. There's a whole bus. Um, apparently you may have to take the front bumper off to make it stick. So if that's the case, we were doing it wrong. Holy Jesus, is this loud today or is it just me? Okay, <laughs> this is... This is excessively loud. Hopefully, it's not so loud where it's a problem. All right, okay, here we go. See, okay, wait a minute, wait a minute. Stop, 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 stop. Uh, okay, I need to try something. No, there's a bus coming. This is a, this, is this a terrible idea? Am I, am I gonna get hit by a bus? Stop, please. Oh God. Okay, just, just, okay. Okay, just relax, buddy. I just want to try something, okay? All y'all need to shut up. This is so loud right now. Where, where's your engine? I can't remember. Oh, is it on the other side? You need to stop that immediately. I need to borrow this for a second, all right? Just chill. Oh my god, it totally works. Well, sugar beets. Oh god, that is so loud. Why is that so freaking loud? What the heck is going on? Okay, so we know that works. So a twin turbo V8 Trabant is coming our way very soon. Once again, I'm adjusting my microphone after I've started recording. <laughs> oh, the foolishness that is me. I'm going to turn this volume down a bit. It's just so loud right now. Jeez, what is going on? It's so very, you know why? Because I've been playing Dying Light 2. And look at the distant mountains. It's all snow. Um, and that game is fairly quiet for some reason. So I got to turn the volume up and then when I'm done playing it, and I haven't played it for several days because I've been working, but it's just one of those things. Besides, I think the Trabant would be great um, as a VAE. Oh God, car. Uh, and also, I've heard too with the mod that the radiator falls off super easy, so that could be a problem. <laughs> I guess. Oh crap! Oh crap! 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 Crabity crap! 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 Uh, it was 160.6. We stopped the last one, right? Yeah. So we need to get to 210.6. Jeez, I just just about forgot that. Okay, there we go. Just double checking to make sure I was right about that. I remember. I, re I remember. <laughs> Whoa! What was that? There's a bus or a truck. What is that? It's a truck. There's a bus. <laughs> oh God, bus! What are you doing, bud? Don't you sneak back out on the road. Okay, okay. This is the wild west today. What is what is going on here? My twin turbo V8 Lada is is having trouble here, staying on the road. <laughs> In typical scapegoat fashion. Okay. Look, we gotta climb a giant hill. What the heck? I can see it coming from miles away. Is there at least a stop before we get there? Before we gotta put our car through this, like, what is that? Um, the big hill climb there in Washington. Oh, I can't. Pikes Peak. Yeah, you can drive up there normally when they're not racing, but there's like brake points so your car can have a chance to cool down. Because <laughs> it's really hard on a car to climb a hill like that for long periods of time. Cars are not designed for such things. Whoop. There we go. Okay. Okay. Well, I guess they are designed for that because they have whole races dedicated to climbing hills. But you know what I mean. Regular cars. Everyday street cars are not designed for that. Now, an electric car would probably actually do pretty well on that because less likely anything's going to overheat. But hey, what do I know? Okay, let's see. Oh, oh, we got nothing. We got nothing. Is there anything coming up here? Like a little building we could stop at or have a good time? Oh, oh. see that? Just about died. Like, it's got to be something to see a twin-turbo V8 Lada come roaring up behind you. That is a trailer. Okay, excellent. Oh. Out of the way, bud. I'm busy. I got I to gotta go. Excuse me. 
Oh god, oh no, oh sugar. Okay, yeah, you know what, bud? I don't like that at all. Perfect. Okay, here we go. <laughs> okay. Well, we didn't lose too much. Yeah, I just think it's time for a change. All right, here we go. And I think that we're going to affect that change by finding a Lada and putting a twin turbo V8 in it. Because I've always, or so not a Lada, a Trabon. I've always been quite uh, impressed with the Trabant's handling. Now, this obviously is going to be a lot, oof, a lot more power than the Trabant was ever intended to have. So that may have dire consequences. It's like if you've ever driven uh, like a 2005 to 2010 Mustang that has a ton of extra power. They were not designed to have a ton of extra power. That chassis was never designed to anything over about 500 horse and it's just ridiculous. And then if you don't put in like subframe connectors and all that crap, it's just monstrously flexible. Anything below 500, fair enough, it works, works a treat. But anything over that, you gotta really like dig deep. <laughs> and like figure out ways to stiffen the whole thing up. Otherwise, it feels sketchy as hell. That's the way it is. Same with the uh, newer Camaros, uh, up until the very newest models. Uh, we're the same thing. Anything over about 600 horsepower, and they were a little bit sketchy. They're just not designed to be... Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, oh, I threaded the needle there. Do you see that? Basically a god. You know, I could have sworn this was all white in the distance there, but, you know, whatever. I don't know, there's something about that that uh, spooling up of the turbos that I find absolutely delicious. I don't, <laughs> I don't know what it is, but it's a good time. Look at Rock coming through. I feel like this car is almost like a hero car from like a really bad 80s movie, you know? Oh, wait a minute, what's this? This is something nasty happened here. What happened? What happened? Look at this bus, just, just chilling, man. You know what that means. You gotta mess with the bus. Oh, what I what I pull off? Whatever it was, it really slowed it down. <laughs> okay. This is not a friendly gas pump. What is this? Oh, we could use a bagel. All right, a bagel. A croissant. What am I? Bagel? Oh, is he coming back to get me? What's he doing? What are you doing, bud? What? What did you? What did I do to make you so upset? <laughs> There you go. Just have at it, all right? Perfect. Okay, so we're back in the... What are we at? Okay, so... We've already gone 12 kilometers, roughly. No Trabant yet. I didn't... I totally did not read the mod. I figured they would just put a space in it for the radiator. But they... Like, put the, for the Trabant radiator mod. But yeah, apparently you gotta take the front bumper off. I had no idea. I get for not reading instructions. But then again, I'm classically a person who doesn't read instructions. So, oh, oh no. Ah! Oh, 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 okay. What, what is that back there? Is that, is that a door? Is that my, is that my door? That's my door. Okay, look here, game. <laughs> I don't have time for this. Okay, just... Okay, dude, stop, 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 stop. Okay, just gotta get to the right spot. Okay. I can't quite reach it. Okay, here, grab it, put it on. All right, go, <laughs> go, go, go. Drag launch. Lose all my traction going uphill, there we go. Perfect. Oh yeah, squeal, squeal those tires. Perfect. There's always a little tire squeal on the on the hills because getting traction going uphill is is hard in this game. So this isn't abnormal, <laughs> but that's just I love that this whole thing the tires do. It's great. Oh yes. Suck it, game. Look, I still got my headlights, too, I think. You know, this is a good one. 
Um, this is this is so far a good day. You know what? It's gonna be like 12 episodes now before I find another Tremont. I should have just drove back and found the other one. Uh, should we? Like, what, okay. What, what do we got coming up here? I want to sleep drive, but it's really hard to sleep drive on hills because you lose momentum quick. <laughs> and when you lose momentum quick, uh, you'll start rolling backwards down the hill, and that does not make for good sleep driving. Oh, geez, I should probably turn my headlights on, shouldn't I? Or maybe we'll park for the night when we get to the top of this hill. It's getting really hard to see the rocks, so it's probably a good idea I do stop. Or turn on my lights anyway. You know, we'll stop here for a second. We'll pass some time. There we go. This is a dangerous spot to just park your car for the night. And... Perfect. Okay. There we go. Come on, baby. I'm not sure what that tanker truck's doing, but he's doing it really well. <laughs> There we go. Come on. I just think like a twin turbo Trabant's going to be insanely hilarious. And I think that it, like they handle really well. So maybe we can combine the two into something fun. I have no idea. We're going to find out though. The second we find a Trabant that's serviceable. Hell, I'll take one that's not serviceable. No doors are necessary to make this, <laughs> to make this a good time. And it only doesn't hold very much fuel either. So, okay, that's every time it gets to the edge of the road. Whoa, okay, that was just about death. death. Perfect, okay, here we are at a gas station. That's a little trailer. Look at this, look at that little Tremont go, okay. See how fast that little Tremont is? Wait till I have my V8 in there. I'm not sure how they get those Trabots going that fast, to be honest. But I'd be happy to get away from the always having to slam my car off the ground. <laughs> See, like, and then this stuff happens. Oh, God, what is happening over here? That little Trabot, poor Trabot. <laughs> Excuse me, coming through. Look out. Don't honk at me, fool. I got a bus. Whoa, there's a rock right there. Okay. Every time I get going a little bit fast, the car spins out now. Any little bounce and the car's spinning out. There we go. Come on. I like to hit the cars like drop out of the sky and slam into the ground. <laughs> yeah, if that was me, I'd lose all my tires. My doors would fall off. We could use a drink and some snacks right now, actually. Can we poop? Oh, we did. Okay, excellent. Poop, drive in. Poop, drive in. <laughs> poop, drive in. Drive in when I'm shitting my pants in the edge of the snow. Okay. Poop, drive in. <laughs> oh, okay. Here we go. Oh, I'm missing a mirror now. Who cares? I don't need a mirror on that side. It's on the other side. I want a mirror anyway. You can actually used to be able to buy cars with only one mirror. How crazy is that? Ooh. I don't know what that mountain's doing in the distance there, but it looks creepy as hell. Oh God, this is, this is so steep. Just give me a Tremont, baby. That's all I'm asking. Oh God, dude, we got so many cars coming down here so fast. Get out of the way. Look at all the cars coming down the hill. Look at them all. Oh, there's another one. Yeah, you guys can go that fast if you want. Okay, there we go, look out. Whoa. No! No! Uh, uh. Okay, that was funny. Alright. Oh, what happened? I'm a little bloody. There's my mirror, I think. Okay. We're totally missing a door. <laughs> like, okay, this is a door. Can I have this door, please? Hey, both the doors are right here. Cool. Perfect. And, uh... 
Oh, I had it. Where'd it go? Oh, there it is. Perfect. Okay. Excellent. Being we're going to ditch this car, I'm not super concerned. Is that a hubcap? I think that is a hubcap. Oh, oh God. It's, it's, it's Volkswagen cop, v Volkswagen cop, shouting Volkswagen cop, coming down the hill too fast. Volkswagen cop, car is a bounce and Volkswagen cop. Okay. Look out. Okay. Got dude. Oh my God. What is happening with the devil roads here? Holy shnikes. What is happening? Oh, jeez, it crackers. What? Oh. Okay, dude, you gotta get out of the way here. We got we got buses or something coming down behind. It's all it's all very very slidey sideways business. Okay. That poor bus. <laughs> How are they staying on the road and I can't? Like, like I, I I'm a pretty good driver in this game, but I don't understand why they have better control than me. Okay, excellent. Oh, wh where'd he go? Okay. Now there is water here I could breathe. You know what? I might stop in here. Because sometimes, well, these always have water. This thing is just spinning out every single time I do anything. Like, if I turn it all today, it's just spinning out. At least I'm not having too many ridiculous accidents, I guess. All right, excellent. Let's go uh, see if there's any food right there. I know there's water. Water, here we go. Oh, better. Okay. There's got to be some food laying around here somewhere, right? Oh, a toilet. Not not for food, I'm just saying. Perfect. Okay, that's enough of that water. It's got to be a little bit of food around here, most likely. Oh, here's a chocolate bar. Is a chocolate bar? Yes, it is. Mmm. Mmm, chocolate. I am the chocolatier. The haunted chocolatier. By the way, that's a game. It's coming out by the same guy that made Stardew Valley. You should go check it out. It looks good. Oh, okay. It's just one trailer, but, you know, I like the art style and everything. This is not... What the heck? What kind of mother-in-law door is this? All right, here we go. Up here. Uh, I don't see any more food. Remember, don't fall off. You die. Okay, okay. What is that out there? Is that... No, what is that? Okay, can I drop here? Oh, don't die, don't die. What is that? Is that is that meats? Are those meats? Those are meats. Oh God. Ugh. Okay, Jesus crackers. Okay, not cool, boss. All right, here we go. Okay, here we are. I'm gonna open this up. I'm gonna pick this up. I'm gonna dump this gas in here. Okay, so so far it's been a little bit of a uh, a trip. I gotta tell you, a little uh, a little crazy. We got a little bit of food in it, so that's good. Don't have any spray. Coily and Loggington are all right. Wait a minute. Do I have spray? No, I don't. Wait a minute, is it in the trunk? Let me just double check. Nope. Okay. Just my road lotion. Gotta can't save that for uh, my alone time. You know, I miss the days when I used to have to track it all down. Everybody's like, lock it down in the... Lock it down in the, in the baskets. And now it's not nearly as much fun. <laughs> it was way more hilarious when uh, it's all like flying all over the place during accidents and I had to chase it down. <laughs> I like doing stupid crap in games. I don't know why people have such a problem with this. It's like people forgot how to have fun. It's like they had fun once and they just forgot. I think it's hilarious chasing things across the desert um, <laughs> when it rolls under your car, especially when it's stuff like road lotion and poop. Now I see a, I see a, a I think I see a building on the horizons. So we're gonna go. Oh god, this is this is gonna be not fun. I think I saw a building out this way, and I kind of I kind of want a Trabant thing like, really bad. Okay, let's, uh... Ooh, might want to slow down a little bit. It's getting pretty It's getting pretty intense. Maybe I just saw a rock. I thought I saw a building out here. Maybe it was this rock. Yeah, maybe I was wrong. It does happen from time to time. Not often. Oh, 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 okay, yeah. See that little bump there? Just caused me all sorts of hell. There we are. Is that a, is that a large gas station? What is that? What is, is that? A, it might be. Now, if any place is going to have a Trabant, it'll be a large gas station. They're littered with them. It's like everybody traded up to a better car. <laughs> now, the trouble with the Trabant will be, uh, if there's anything in the fuel tank in that thing, it's hard to get out because the fuel tank is in a weird spot on a Trabant. It's under the hood. Okay, here we go. 
Come on, slide, slide in here. Oh, we got a vehicle here. What is it? Not a Trabant. It's a Dasha. Well, not exactly what I was looking for. I don't think a twin turbo Dasha is be any good because it's front wheel drive. And what good is front wheel drive and, and twin turbo V8s? But it's worth the explore. Besides, we might have some spray here we can fix this up with. Diesel. Diesel. Oh, spray. They rare. Perfect. We're going to fix up the car and keep this spray for the next inevitable accident we'll have. Boom. Four. All right. What was that? Now, Coily, Loggington, I need you to look after this spray and my meats, all right? So don't do not do that. There we go. Thank you. All right. This is one of the first times I've been through and a board isn't covering the door. Uh, interesting. Hmm. I could go with a little more food, though. Boy, fridges are super heavy. Okay, let me see. Oh, yes. Perfect. Okay, excellent. Again, I've discovered you really don't need to carry food. If you're just to be a little bit mindful of it, it seems to be pretty easy to find. Actually, you know, ooh, this is nice. Okay, where was it now? Oh, there's chocolate right here. What the heck? All right, there's nothing here worth taking. What's in here? A little bit of oil. You know what? I haven't checked it. Check, checked? I haven't checked the oil in a while, so let's uh, let's do that. Ah, you know what's not bad, but I'll, I'll put that in there just because I can. All right, back on the road. Where, where are we? What did I say? 210.6, right? Yeah, we're getting there. Perfect. Okay. It's just... I. Whoa! <laughs> I did not look that way before I crossed. Jeez, that was a dangerous situation right there. I know somebody who's an idiot for not checking before they got on the road. Oh, God, he's coming down the hill real fast, too. I'm getting off the road. Oh, here he comes. Oh, 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 yeah, there you go. Okay, just, it's a, it's the station wagon variant. All right. <laughs> Oh no! It happened again! That back end is like, it just ejects you. It's a mass coronal ejection. Well, no, it's not a sun, it's a car, but you know what I mean. It just, every time it hits a bump, it just, it, oh, look at him go! Look at him go! Oh no! Oh, bud! Oh shit! You're on your wheels! Oh god! The devastation! What? What is happening? Oh god, he's still making a play for it. Jesus, what a trooper, man. Look at this guy go. <laughs> what a what a trooper. Look at him. He's like, I have places to be. Three tires or four. I'm going. Look at you go, bud. You know what? You, you are a credit to Humentia. Right? You just killed some grass, too? Jeez, look at you. You are just killing it, bud. Somehow, with three wheels, you're still better at driving than I am at the moment. No, I don't want to lose my friend. No! Scooter brother! No, no, no. Oh, damn it. I'm, I'm over this car. Like, it handles decent enough, but any, like, this type of road, no problem. But the seat, like, second it bounces, it just wants to, the rear end just wants to bounce and then eject you all over the map. Oh, God. Oh, God. We got another car coming. I'm over this, this bouncing and slamming into the ground business. So one thing I wish the long drive devs would do is just stiffen up the suspensions by about 20% on the rear of these cars. I'm not complaining. You know, they're still hilarious to drive, but any real speed and they'll just throw you. So it would be nice if it didn't hit the ground every time. You hit any sort of like even littlest bumps. Because it doesn't take much. Like the tiniest little undulation in the road and this thing's like, oh yeah, okay, like right here. Bam. Man, like a car should not bottom out that easily. Or maybe you should be able to like tune the suspension, you know, adjust the shocks or whatever. Look at it, it's sitting low too. Maybe it's because I'm carrying around Coily and Karen and all that, but I feel like a blow up doll and two poos is not going to weigh that much. Like I know there isn't exactly a good reputation for Ladas and reliability, but 
Like, I think it'd be a little more, a little more reliable than that. Oh, oh yeah, just, just every turn, every turn bounces and kicks and fights with you. It's ridiculous. Okay, here we go. I'm trying to stay concentrated. It's hard. <laughs> it really is hard. Whoa. And you can really get it going on the straightaways, but once you have to turn, you, you cannot be on the gas in this car. It's just, 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 just beat the shit out of it. Yeah, take it. Take it like a man. All right, here we go. Oh, God. Oh, God. That's a rock. That's, that's, oh, God. We're going to flip now. There it is. Oh. Oh, God. Oh, no. Stop. Stop, please. Please stop. Okay, well. This has gone off the rails slightly. Um, okay, well, we lost two tires. And it's turning nighttime. Which is... Oh, God. Always look. Forgot. Jeez, not the first time today I've done that. Okay, here we go. We lost, I think we lost both our headlights. We're bleeding again. We're still... We're walking away. Hopefully it'll stay there. <laughs> I think I got the parking brake on. Okay, let's see. Look at all the parts I lost. We lost the whole friggin' door. Not cool, bud. I don't care about a bumper so much, but like... Yeah, someone's lamenting in the comments that they missed the days when I used to rebuild the entire cars. Do you see what I have to tolerate to do that? <laughs> like, when the cars handle this bad, you're just kind of stuck with them. Nope, not what I wanted. Thank you. Okay. Because, you know, having a door is nice. Well, now we've lost both our headlights, too. Okay, here we go. Okay, dude, don't slide down the hill, please. Oh, no. Perfect. Where's the door? Oh, there it is. It's blending into the terrain. <laughs> okay, so I, I'm over this car um, pretty quickly, actually. Because it's, it's, I hate it. Um, you know, I'm going to sleep for the night so I can at least see. Oh my God. It just, every time you hit a bump, it'll just like spin around on you. Now it doesn't help that I'm doing 160, you know, 170 kilometers an hour most of the time. Ugh. Did that get it finally? Okay, there we go. Now I gotta somehow get this in here. Well, I'm on this side. I should just pull the car up, please. Okay. Good enough. Okay, good enough. Good enough. I don't even care anymore. <laughs> All right, car. Come on. Come on, car. Come on. Okay, we're going to leave the bumper. We're out, out of here. Perfect. Okay, so how far? You know what? This is beginning to make me upset. <laughs> we only got about 10 kilometers to cover, which is not the worst. It's These double buildings are weird because sometimes there's a car parked out front here, and other times it's just, like, absolutely barren except for... But there's always wooden pallets. You almost never see one that doesn't have wooden pallets. And you see... Yeah, you see this problem a lot. Buses on roofs. But I hate the double buildings. They killed me once. I have, a, I have a test game that I run and I test mods and different things I want to try out before I try them in my main game. And, uh... Yeah, like, every time I've ever died doing something, it's usually at a double building. <laughs> it's like, just jump off something, you'll die. You know, you get hit by a bus right there. Nice. When I, fr when I first installed the, uh... The traffic mod, I was like, yes, yeah. so I installed it and I hopped into my game and I just happened to be stopped there and I turned around and I heard the bus and I turned around and it ran me over. So like not exactly looking looking good. There we go. This is alright. So what I say I needed 210.6, right? Oh no, 
Oh no, oh no. There we go. Also, too, to all the people complaining that all I do in Mamba Zoo is uh, maple syrup, I hear you, but this is the way the game works. <laughs> if you want to make money, you pretty much have to do maple syrup. Now, I'm currently making enough money where uh, I could probably stop doing it, but if I really want... If I really want to make the big money, I'm going to have to get at least, I figure, eight barrels and enough trees to support that. And that's about as best. Now, I'll try to do it in my spare time, but I have no spare time. I keep telling people this. They don't seem to understand. I don't just play games for fun very often. Like, I managed to get Dying Light 2 and play it a little bit. But, because I really enjoyed the original Dying Light. But uh, it's a rare occurrence where I have time to play games just for fun anymore. Now, don't get me wrong. I enjoy playing these games. But I'm more concerned about making sure I get to entertain people than I am about my own personal time. So having time to sit down and just play Mamba Zoo for a couple hours so I can get ahead in money is, is just something I can't do. Now, on the plus side is maple syrup's going great. What did I make, like 1600 bucks or something? It was really crazy anyway. Whoa, whoa, what happened? Why, why is it suddenly... Oh! You can see, you can see the uh, spray just rolling around in the back window. Okay, we're just about at where we need to be. We did not find another Trabant yet. Which is kind of sad, really. But we will find one eventually. You can't go too far in the long drive without finding a Trabant. <laughs> it's just kind of the rules of the game. They always want to inundate you with the worst cards. Oh, here we go. Nice little bouncity bouncity bounce. There we go. Perfect. Nice. Thank you. Ow. I wonder if they're ever adds if they're ever going to add transmission swaps to the game, where you could like pull a transmission out and and go from like a three to a four gear or something. What? What was that? Sounded like I just opened something. All right. Well, whatever. Oh my god, what the heck? Now, don't get me wrong, I love playing Mamba Zoo and I like doing all the new things. But I'm trying to do that series as a, like, what it would be like if you're trying to do it yourself. And I, for all the people say I'm not planting trees, I plant like four or five every time I'm in the game, at a minimum. Again, I don't have time <laughs> to be <laughs> planting a thousand trees when I'm trying to record an episode. Oh god, what was that that just fell through the floor? Oh no, what was that? I think it was a bike. Okay. Uh, let's see here. Where are we at? Okay, we got about 600 meters to cover. <laughs> but we're still going to check this place out. Halt. I hear you. And all the people that constantly want me to shoot those guys to see what would happen, it doesn't do anything. <laughs> I got to... If, if it did anything, I would do it, but it does not do anything. People are very concerned about shooting stuff all the time. I don't understand. I, in life, I don't know about everybody else, I avoid trying to shoot people as often as possible. <laughs> Call me crazy. But I believe shooting shooting stuff at random is just a bad idea. Um, that's how people get hurt. All right, back in the car. We got like about 600 meters to cover, not too much, and we are off. Okay, let's see if we can just do it on a roll. Perfect. This is a little downhill section, nice little quiet finishing up of this episode. Well, temporarily, because it goes right back uphill again, so. <sighs> what do we at? 1.1. Oh, what was that? It was something. <laughs> Two. Oh, we're not going to make it because of this freaking hill. I just want to point out that we're doing 100 kilometers an hour doing nothing but rolling. Oh, I might make it actually. Five. That's a rock. Oh, no. Uh, there, six. Perfect. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to leave this episode here uh, with my car kind of facing. You know what's going to happen? I'm going to jump in the next episode and I'm going to drive the wrong way. I can feel it. So... 
Uh, why are all the doors suddenly falling off this car all constantly? Get, cop? Wait a minute. You're lucky, bud. <laughs> you are so lucky. So anyway, yes, I'm going to leave this episode here. So thank you so much for watching. If you like this, please leave a comment and maybe subscribe. Um, maybe get your kids to subscribe. Maybe get your grandma to subscribe, your dentist, your mail person, your fire local fire department, um, uh, Girl Stout Troop Local 418. Yeah, join up. And if you didn't like this, well, you should probably find yourself a real YouTuber because I am not much of one. Thank you again so much for watching. Love every view I get. Scapegoat! That guy's got my dream car. It's a wobbly, though. Out.